Ten Hut. Hey guys, General Splatton here for Splatton Studios. This is actually a commission piece that I've just done. This is a Kadai Fireborn uh, from Forge World, part of the Chaos Dwarf uh, commission that I'm doing. Uh, cool model, but I want to show it here because uh, a lot of people wouldn't see it on my other channel, Splatton Studios. And I wanted to talk about this uh, miniature for you guys to uh, tell you a few things about it. First of all, it is very, very tough to paint. It is a resin model. Uh, uh, there was a pretty good bit of flash on it. Mold lines, not so much of a big deal, but the flash, because of all the little crevices and flames and everything, made it very difficult to get clean. Uh, as far as the painting goes, it was very difficult because you got all these little crevices in here and get into the flames. And it was just one of the hardest miniatures I've ever had to paint. So I wanted y'all to be aware of that uh, if you decide to get some of these as a collectible or uh, to put in an army. Uh, they're cool models, no question. They're about twice the height of uh, a regular miniature. Uh, and just to, uh, they, they look neat on the table, but just like I said, they're very difficult to paint. And uh, so uh, easy to assemble. Uh, what I've done here to, to keep the theme of the army for those of you who've been following on the other channel the Chaos Dwarfs uh, uh, are mainly black uh, with red in them and then uh, copper and brass accents and if they're carrying any weapons they're regular steel color and on lava bases so I got it coming up out of a lava base I don't know if it's picking it up but it's kind of quiet going up into the colors now as far as I also wanted to explain a little about the theme of it, um, you would think since it's a creature of fire, it'd all be you know glowing hot. Uh, but I didn't want to do that. First of all, I wanted to uh, fit in with the rest of the army, so it has the same colors. The armor's black, and then got the uh, brass and copper highlight uh, or accents on it. Uh, the crown is uh, brass, and obviously the weapons, you know, got a glow effect going there. I figure he's a magical creature, so if he was all fire, he would consume. Uh, what he's wearing and what he's using his weapons so he's got a magical ability that he so he doesn't uh, consume uh, the stuff that's on him and also uh, so that way they'd be you know uh, differences of the model more interest that way by the the the, the copper plates or the um, silver of the weapons or the uh, armor itself so you know it's a unifying theme but also adding interest to the model so that's the thought processes behind uh, that as well I think it turned out well this is a level 2 model but very hard to paint and I just wanted to share that with you uh, because of all the little fire in between the copper plates there and the brass plates and the fire that's rising up through it just uh, really really tough now on his face is um, to add unity or continuity you have got the bright yellow down here the hands are more yellow and then the face is yellow reason being I think you know the face is expressive that's where it's going to show anger and hatred so it would be glowing more hot and it's uh, actually hi highlighted in white so um, so you got the yellow the face and the hands and then the yellow toward the bottom so that was the thought processes behind that as well uh, and why I did what I did uh, and obviously rising up out of the uh, lava with the rock there surrounding it. I uh, thought it turned out pretty cool. Uh, very, very challenging uh, for you that uh, thinking about maybe getting some of these, so be aware of that. If you have any questions about that or anything that I did, let me know. I think they tie in pretty cool with the rest of the army. I'll show i got two more of them that are well on their way, but I wanted to show this one here on this channel to give you a heads up and let you see it because a lot of people won't see it on Splatten Studios and I'll do a reveal of all three later on. Uh, picks to follow. Uh, tell me what you think about it and if you have any questions I'll be happy to answer them. This is General Splatten and I'll talk again. Dismissed.